And I don't know how the Screaming Trees ended up co-producing Jamboree, but uh, considering all of the fights and shit we went through making Screaming Trees records, it was very easy to work with Mark and Lee on this. Those two guys work great together as Beat Happening producers. I'm trying to think about what ideas they had, if any. I think they were there more to approve things. As someone who's produced many records, having somebody that the artist trusts and says, no, that's a good take. I think they just, you know, thought we're coming to Ellensburg to do it, so it'd be cool to have you guys be around and just kind of advise and stuff. And I, yeah, we I don't remember what we did too much, except standing around playing a few things. You know, that was like um, kind of being around kind of changed the vibe of the whole thing because, you know, we were all friends and stuff and just having a good time. Yeah, I mean, what I do remember is just having other voices in the room, you know, opinions and input. They created a, a space of reverence for the whole project and the value of what we were doing. They were willing to be there, investing time in it. Like, gosh, these, they must care because they're hanging out here. Maybe they don't have anything else better to do, but they were there. They were there. <laughs> and they were, they were, uh, they cared. And, and that always meant something to me. And I don't remember any particular suggestions. I do remember maybe that there was some back and forth arguing between um, Steve and Lee and Mark, but I always just interpret that as like just um, for the fun of it more than substantive problems. At that point, Lee and Mark and Steve, it was more like sibling rivalry or something. They were just bickering about stupid stuff all the time. But yeah, that first day when we were doing all the basic tracks on this, like Bewitched and... uh crashing through and stuff and just looking up in the booth and seeing Steve and Mark and, and Lee and Steve. And I just remember after Bewitched and um, both Mark and Lee were just laughing and just, it was like, yeah, you did it. It was, it was kind of exciting. They were like, that was it. You did it. 